19 minutes for nine o'clock. Delighted to have Chris Surratt here, Pinky, with us this morning, who's been training out of the Charlotte Athletic Club in the Duke Energy Building, right? Correct, correct. And uh, he has his own uh, fitness training business. You're going to want to hook up with him. It's called Pinky's. Pinky the Trainer. Pinky the Trainer, and you want to find out more about what he's got going here. It's great to have you on the program. It's this good morning. to be here. Thanks Pinky. for having me. Yeah, and uh, that name comes from his dad, though. Uh, we want to give him credit for that as well, too. Absolutely. But this training, how would you characterize what you're doing, Chris? Um, I'm a personal trainer, uh, also exercise physiologist. What I like to do is a lot of high-intensity interval training, body weight training. Um, I also do group fitness over at Charlotte Athletic Club, as you can see some of my videos from one of my classes. Uh, I have a class called Explode. It's uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays, 11.30 to 12.15. A lot of high-intensity workouts. Excellent for everyone. Oh, wow. And you got a good background in this, too. I mean, you're just not some guy who just decided you wanted to do this. And I'll tell me a little bit about your background. Right. I have my bachelor's in exercise science from Georgia State University, and I also have my master's in kinesiology with a specialization in clinical exercise physiology from UNC Charlotte. Oh, wow. So, in other words, this guy knows what he's doing. Just a little bit. Yeah, just a just little, little bit. bit. What, can anyone get involved in a program like this, basically? And the in learning to in, in trying to make themselves healthier and training and working out. Absolutely, okay. exercises for everybody. We okay. were we were meant to move by nature. That's that's what we were built to do. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So a, a lot of issues we run into is when we sit down for long periods of time. You know, today uh, yeah. today's culture you have a lot of desk jobs. Uh huh. And that's one thing that I want to try and combat. Oh, wow. And you've got this uh, ball here. I've seen these. I see these over at the uh, Aquatic Center where I go over, but I've never really used one of these. Tell me the purpose of these balls. All right. So this is a, called a Swiss ball or stability ball or exercise ball. Basically, you can do a whole bunch of different types of exercises for it. But what I brought it here for today was is for people that sit at desk jobs uh -huh. using an exercise ball versus a regular chair. Helps promote a strong core. Increases the posture. Should I sit on this thing? You should. I'm gonna sit on this. Absolutely. See. So I could I can have this at my desk. <laughs> oh, okay. There you go. There you <laughs> go. Well see how your back's nice and straight. Yeah, all right. Chest so, is nice and high. Uh, Excellent. Yeah, it is. So I don't know if I could use this at the anchor desk. Uh, yeah, you might have to you leave a little platform. You have to balance yourself a little bit here, too. Absolutely. So what do you think about those standing desks that you that Standing desks are excellent. Really? Uh, that pr promotes standing up, of course. You're not sitting down all day. Yeah. And with the standing desk, you don't have to stand the whole day. You can stand for maybe five, ten minutes, uh -huh. lower it back down. And also what I'm finding out is a lot of companies will provide the desk for their um, workers. Uh, well, we all know we need more exercise. What do you think is the greatest barrier people have to getting started? Time. Really? A lot of people yeah. complain about not having time. Busy lives, you have a busy work schedule, busy home life, you got to go home to family, cook, and that's the main barrier. So what I find is if you can actually just get to the gym, if you can just start maybe one day a week, then graduate to two days a week, and then maybe three, you'll see a lot of progress. All right. Give me your website one more time. PinkyTheTrainer.com. P-I-N-K-I-E, TheTrainer.com. PinkyTheTrainer.com. you got to hook up with this guy. He is in great shape himself, and he can help you get you there. Too, Absolutely. Well. Hey, Chris, Pinky, thank you so much for thank being you. with us this morning. Hope to have you back. Maybe Absolutely. show us some more stuff. Absolutely. All right, 845 the time. Let's check in now with meteorologist Sal Conklin. John, nice job on that ball there. That, that, that could have gone sideways real fast, so good for you. All right, hey.